Hey guys, Brian and PS4 Trophies, and I'm going to show you how to earn all the end game bonus rewards. That includes the infinite ammo, walking shoes, x ray glasses, the circular saw, the Albert O1, and then the secrets of the fence and the essence of the fence. So there's various things you have to do, criteria you got to meet in order to unlock them. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how to do that. Now, first off, when you've unlocked them, you start a new game or you reload. Of your current save or an older save, a previous save, all you need to do to get them is go to an item box. So automatically be placed in your item box across all your save files. Now when you do have them in your item box, you're going to have to transfer them into your inventory to take advantage of any of their bonuses. So it's really easy, just go to an item box and move it over. Now there's a trade-off of course, you're going to lose an inventory uh, slot once you've equipped one, but you can move it in or out as often as you want. Now let's go ahead and tell you how to get the Albert 01 and the secrets of defense. Simply complete the game. The Albert 01 of course is the pistol you get at the very end of the game. You get to use it throughout whatever playthrough you want next. It's going to give you better damage than the gun you the handgun you started with, but it does have a smaller magazine. Now the secrets of defense is really cool because it's going to reduce the amount of damage you take when you block an attack. Very critical on Madhouse difficulty to block and reduce damage. Now, the walking shoes and the essence of defense. Walking shoes and the essence of defense are required when you destroy all of the Mr. Everywhere statuette bobbleheads. So once you complete the game, if you've collected all 20 of them, or destroyed all of them rather, you will get these two items. Now the walking shoes is going to increase your base walking speed. It does not increase your run speed, however. So I don't know how worth it it is, but the essence of defense, very much like the secrets of defense, is going to lower the amount of damage you take when you block an attack. However, if you have both the essence of defense and the secrets of defense in your inventory, in your bag, at the same time, when you block an attack, it'll completely negate all damage, which is spectacular, especially on Madhouse difficulty against the bosses. Now the x-ray glasses and the circular saw, you will earn these by completing a speed run of the game on any difficulty in less than 4 hours. The x-ray glasses are really nice because it's going to highlight all the pickups, all the items, the, the ammo pickup, herbs, things like that. It's going to highlight all of them for you. Now the circular saw is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful melee weapon. As soon as you get it, throw away the knife because this is all you need. This is going to allow you to uh, melee enemies without using any ammo, which is useful on Madhouse difficulty. And I'm going to show you some footage at the end here of me against Jack in the boathouse. And you'll see how using the circular saw with the essence and secrets of defense, along with infinite ammo, how I'm able to take down that boss real quick. Now the circular saw, like thumbs up for me. Now the infinite ammo the one everyone wants. Unfortunately, you're going to have to complete the game on Madhouse difficulty at least once before you can get this. But it's pretty self-explanatory. You can walk around with the, the grenade launcher and just shoot the uh, grenades all day long without having to worry about trying to find more ammo. It's an awesome thing, but of course, you have to complete Madhouse. At that point, you're probably done with the game. But there it is. So I'm going to leave you guys with some footage, as I mentioned, of, of the fight against Jack on Madhouse difficulty in the boathouse. I hope you guys enjoy that. See you soon.
forth. Hmm. <laughs> 